Hey guys, this is Dapsun Ishmael. Dividers have been part of Wizzywood Web Builder for some time now. And um, the dividers we were used to were horizontal dividers, as you can see on this page over here as I scroll. You notice that all these dividers are horizontal dividers. But a good thing is that Wizzywood Web Builder version 17 allows you to also have vertical dividers, which look something like this or this based on the type of divider you select so let's go ahead and take a look at how to add dividers to layout grid that is vertical dividers as well as to layers and then also to cards in wizard web builder version 17. so on my wizard web builder i'm going to go ahead to search for a layer so i'm going to start with the layer first and i'm going to click on it and then draw in here so to make my divider visible i'm going to go ahead to change the color that's the background color of this layer so i'll double click on it head over to the style section and then make this um uh, a bit of like a different color so it's visible so we can see that here now I'll come back and then go to the section where i have dividers now dividers i'm going to leave the orientation where it is but I'm going to go ahead to select a type. So maybe cloud. Let's see how cloud to look. So this is how cloud to look. Now I'm going to go ahead to come back here and maybe change the color a bit. So it looks, um, even though the white is visible, I would want something a bit more different. So as you can see, this looks very much visible. I'll come back to my dividers and to be able to get the horizontal aspect that is vertical aspect this is what i'm going to definitely vertical doesn't change it to be vertical it only moves it to the other side so that is not what you want to so come back and then change this and rather hit on rotate so when we select rotate this is what is going to move it to the uh, vertical section of the layer now you notice that by default this moves it to the left hand section of the screen in case you would want to move this a little bit to the right or even to the middle, let me show you what to do. So you come back to dividers and where you have offset, you have between um, 1 to 100 to specify any number. So if I specify 50, this is going to move it exactly to the middle of the screen. So as you can see, this is how to go about using the vertical um, dividers. Now if you would want to change this, flip it around you can simply click on flip vertical and this is going to change it to the other side so that is how to go about using a vertical uh, divider and the layer in wizard web builder version 17 so let me go ahead and then bring layout grid also and then we take a look at how to go about that so this is my layout grid i'm going to add a pad into the top which is going to be 150 and then to the bottom also, which is also going to be 150. And then click on OK. And then I'm going to bring some objects into my layout grid to make it easier to work with it. So I'll bring text. I'll populate this with um, some maybe two paragraphs. And then I'll position that in here. So we notice that we have our grid, um, a very good size of it. So maybe let me decrease the pattern to the top and bottom so it doesn't look so huge then i'll double click on it just as we did for the layers or the layer i'll go ahead and then click on dividers select the type of um, um, divider i would want to use maybe let's see how this will look uh, i want something that will be very much visible so blob and change the color to red and then click on ok so you see our uh, um, divider here now come back and then change it to rotate and then flip it and this time around I'm going to move it to the extreme end right hand side of my screen so I'll select that I think that was more let me just um, yeah and as you can see so let me just keep moving it to maybe about 90 and that should be it so maybe 99 yeah, so 99 should get it to the extreme edge for me. So you notice that maybe I can bring it a little bit in there. So maybe 94. And this should look 
okay for me. So if I go ahead to preview this in the browser, it should work fine. So that will be it for um, the layout grid. And then I'll go ahead to do the that of the um, card. So let me come back to the card. Um, let me search for card and click on it and draw in here. So I would get rid of maybe let me just leave, get rid of the header and then the footer and come to dividers and select the type of divider I would want to use a so cloud, the color red as usual and rotate and that is going to flip to the left hand side. So if that is what I want and I'll leave it as that so so that is how to go about using dividers in a vertical way in WYSIWYG Web Builder version 17. There are more objects that you can use dividers in, but for the purpose of this tutorial, we only looked at using it in a card, um, a layout grid, as well as a layer. So thank you very much for watching. In case you are new to this channel, kindly subscribe and don't forget to hit on the bell so that anytime there's a new video, you get to see it.